Well, while COVID-19 vaccine doses have now arrived at several Atlanta area hospitals, many smaller cities and rural communities are still waiting. Joe Hinke spoke with health care providers today from Tacoa and Valdosta. The health care directors I talked with today from smaller Georgia communities tell me they have applied for doses to vaccinate their staff, but so far delivery date is unknown. As the country has ramped back up with COVID, we have realized that our county is red. Our town is red and frankly, our clinic is red. Red meaning COVID-19 transmission is extremely high. That is why Sherry Beavers, executive director of Open Arms Clinic in Tacoa, says her staff is now only seeing patients virtually until her staff can be vaccinated. We're in the early stages and everybody's working as hard as they can to get that vaccine out there. But for rural counties, it's as important as it is for the inner city counties. Previously, state health Biden director Biden Kathleen Biden Toomey Biden said it is the state's Biden goal Biden. to have a vaccine reach rural communities as quickly as metro areas. An issue, though, Pfizer's vaccine needs expensive ultra cold storage units to extend its shelf life. Moderna's yet to be authorized vaccine does not need to be kept as cold, making Moderna the only option possibly in some areas. Beaver says her clinic can thankfully count on nearby Stevens County Hospital but since 2010, at least nine hospitals in other rural areas have closed or announced their closure. For a rural, rural community to have a local hospital is so important. And our hospital has actually purchased two of the extremely uh, low temperature freezers. The only big question mark is when will the vaccine show up? John Sparks, executive director of Partnership Health Center in Valdosta, says the state has been very open with its vaccine distribution plans. The only holdup is availability, which he says is an issue beyond the state's control. He says he could use a Pfizer vaccine to quickly vaccinate his staff, but without ultra cold storage in place, a Moderna vaccine for now may be the only option for his patients. The refrigeration unit that's approved, it's just a matter of, you know, is it back ordered? When will it show up? That type of thing. So. Right now we're not in crisis mode, but at some point we may be.